This video is for a 2004 Pacero. This is the model number 37C. Just want to walk around the outside showing there's mo no major dings, no dents. Very nice unit. Uh, all the decals are in great shape. There's no sun fading on the decals. There's no cracking. On top, this unit does have a king dome on it. It has slide toppers on it. Probably one of the nicer things that I, I, I like about the, the Pace here is they put a driver's side door on, so that's something I definitely wanted to point out. The other thing is if you have a bad back, um, they have their slide out actually has cargo that slides out with it. This is a gel coated unit. Really in great shape all the way around. I mean, a lot of units, you just don't see them in this good a shape. Especially in 2004s in the area that we're at so my my guess is somebody had this covered up somehow because all the decals are in good shape there's no sun fading on it whereas most units in this age in Colorado here they do get a lot of sun fading so um, just really a nice unit all the way around this unit's got roughly about 12,000 miles on it so the mileage is super low you know in here the uh, Paceros, uh, this unit has a, a workhorse chassis that's an 8.1 with an Allison transmission. It's got a rear view camera. You look up top, it's got a uh, about a 27 inch TV. You've got all your electronics over here. You've got leather chairs, solid surface countertop. Double door refrigerator, it's about a 12 cubic foot refrigerator. Come over here, it's got a two burner cooktop. A lot of units have three, three burner cooktops, but on campers, if anybody's used a cooktop on a camper, they know there's just no possible way you're going to get three pots on the stove. So what they do over here on the Pacero, is they go ahead and they add they add um, two burners but they're two large burners you look on the inside you've got a convection microwave over here a nice double deep bold sink on each side very deep you've got a booth dinette if you don't like the booth the booth can definitely come out they're real simple you just take them out and you can put in some chairs there's four screws that hold that dinette over here, that's a, a uh, high to bed sofa on the other side. This is another feature over here. Um, you've got a place to put your canned goods. A lot of times when they put in the double door refrigerator, you lose this spot over here with the canned goods. So Pacero, whoever designed these, really does a great job. You've got another fold out leaf here. This comes out when you're traveling, you have to put it away. Go down to the bathroom, you've got a porcelain sink. Nice size shower. You know, I'm 6'4, I have absolutely no problem standing straight up in this shower. Lots of cabinets around here, lots of hardware, you know, that are a place to put your towels. Really well thought out. It's got a fantastic fan back here in the bathroom. Again, place to put your towels, your toiletry items. Lots of cabinets inside this unit, all the way through tons of space. The double windows coming down the hallway really add to a lot of light. If you notice here, there's lots of light inside this camper. I don't have any of them turned on. So, queen size bed. You go in the back here, you've got another 21 inch TV. A lot of good cabinet storage. Cedar lined. This unit will uh, tow a 5,000 pound uh, car behind it or trailer. There's a laundry hamper. I know it's getting a little dark in here. Laundry hamper back in here. Got a place to put your makeup on back over here. Drawer. If you have any questions about the unit, please give us a call. Be glad to answer them. This is a very nice unit. Shows well. Um, it's probably not a perfect unit. I did notice one little scuff down here on the floor. Um, not much I can do about it, but it's there. So. You know, there's little things here and there, but it's actually all the way through. For a 2004, it's in very good shape, and it should be, you know, you should expect it to be in good shape with only 12,000 miles. So if you have any questions, give me a call.